In this video, I'm going to show you four different passive income apps that you can build as a blockchain developer. And that's one of the craziest things about this space is you can actually create apps that earn you money while you sleep. And, you know, most of the time when you want to monetize an app, like you have to build a pretty complex project, develop some crazy marketing plan to get users, and then actually find a way for people to pay you and make money with the app. But with blockchain, you can create pretty simple applications that will just earn you money and you don't even have to find users. And in this video, I'm going to give you some ideas on how you can do that. So before we get into that, if you're new around here, hey, I'm Gregory. And on this channel, I turn you into a blockchain master. So if that's something that you're interested in, then smash the like button down below for the YouTube algorithm and subscribe this channel. And if you want to learn how to master blockchain step by step from start to finish, then I can show you how to do that over at dappuniversity.com forward slash bootcamp to get started today. So the first app idea is an arbitrage trading bot. So this is an app that you can build that profits off of price discrepancies that happen on cryptocurrency exchanges. Okay. So most people, when they think of trading bots, they think of like, you know, some sort of magic bot that tries to predict the future of cryptocurrency prices. So that's not what this is because that's really risky. All right. I mean, you don't necessarily know what's going to happen in the future. Your model might fail. Instead, this eliminates the risk completely. So basically what it does is it finds price discrepancies on cryptocurrency exchange right now, like not in the future. And it buys a cryptocurrency on one exchange and sells it on another. So for example, you know, let's say you're buying cryptocurrency for a hundred dollars on exchange A, well, then you could turn around and sell it for $101 on exchange B. And now the great thing about blockchain is you can further reduce the risk of this. Okay. You can do this in, in the traditional financial system. You can do it, uh, you know, with regular cryptocurrency exchanges, but we've seen an explosion of decentralized cryptocurrency exchanges that are powered by smart contracts. And you can create a risk-free trading strategy where you can do this because uh, you can write smart contracts that will only execute this trades if they're successful. So there's no way like for this price to move on you uh, when you are trying to trade. And the crazy thing is like you can do this with zero money down. So for example, like if you spot a price discrepancy like this, you don't even have to have any of this cryptocurrency that you're arbitraging because you can use flash loans. This is where you can basically borrow like, you know, millions of dollars in cryptocurrency with zero money down and then use it for trading as long as you pay it back in the same transaction. So I've done several videos about this on my channel, you know, how to create trading bots, how to do flash loans. So definitely check those out. And one of the coolest things about this app is that there's so much potential because there are so many different decentralized cryptocurrency exchanges out there and it seems like new ones are popping up all the time. And that means you have so many different places to look for arbitrage opportunities, okay? And in addition to that, there are so many different ERC20 tokens on the Ethereum blockchain right now, which means that, you know, you can create all these different token pairs that you can trade. So, you know, when you combine uh, a bunch of different tokens, trading pairs, and different decentralized exchanges, that means there's so many opportunities available. So the next app idea is a yield farming app, all right? So what is that? Well, there are so many different projects out there in the DeFi space right now that are issuing tokens, all right? This is like a new token distribution method, a lot like the ICO craze that happened in you know 2016, 2017. But instead of buying tokens, what you do is you supply tokens to the app and you earn a new token for doing that. So for example, this is Compound Finance, where you can supply a stable cryptocurrency like DAI, whose price doesn't change, and you can earn some interest on that DAI, but you can also earn bonus comp tokens tokens, which is their own cryptocurrency as a reward for doing this. Okay. So now normal users who just understand how to use MetaMask can certainly do that inside compound finance as well. But what you can do uh, as a developer, you know, you have a competitive edge here is that you can like supply die to the app and also borrow against your principal with the same cryptocurrency and earn bonus comp tokens for doing that. All right. So in addition to that, you can also use leverage with flash loans to increase the size of your position and earn more comp tokens for doing that. Okay, so I'll show you a calculator here. And so that looks like this. Basically, you know, you supply 100 die to the app and you'll earn bonus comp tokens for doing that. But you can also turn around and borrow die from the app. Okay, so put comp here. And then you can take out a flash loan to increase your position like this. Let's say like, you know, 233 die. All right. And then add those together. All right, and that's going to equal uh, 333 die. And then that goes into the app. And then you can instantly borrow that money back out and pay this flash loan back. So now you have 333 die inside the app when you only had to, you know, own 100 die originally. And so I've recorded a video about this, you know, how I actually created this inside of an app myself. And that's exactly what I showed inside the DeFi Master Class we did a couple weeks ago. And so let me show you how this is actually a more profitable strategy and how you have the edge as a developer. So basically, here's a calculator that shows your comp earnings. So let's just say you wanted to, you know, supply 100 die to the Compound Finance app. Then basically, you know, you could earn 12% APY on that. So that'd be, you know, $12.41. But if you do the strategy I just talked about and you increase that to 333, okay, and then you turn around and borrow 233. 
then your net APY is actually $50, okay? This is about 50% APY as opposed to, you know, much lower percent. And this APY increases quite a bit if the value of comp goes up over time. So the next app idea is a liquidation bot. All right, so what is that? Well, basically, a lot of these protocols that offer, you know, uh, savings and lending, they require users to lock up some sort of collateral uh, in order to take out a loan. Or some of the dApps out there that have leverage trading, you know, require some sort of collateral as well to use those applications. In many of these applications, basically, if your debt becomes too big, then uh, your collateral can get liquidated. So, for example, in Aave right here, like, let's say you supply some DAI and then you borrow a different cryptocurrency, like, uh, I don't know, Tether, for example. Well, basically, if the interest on this accrues over time and then it gets too big, then whatever you know amount of die that you supply to the app could get liquidated. So how can you profit with this? So a lot of these applications have basically a way to reward users for closing out these liquidation positions. So basically like if somebody uh, has die locked in the application and they are able to get liquidated, you can actually process that liquidation. You get a small fee for doing that. And the app, you know, gets their money back because the person who is borrowing is basically delinquent in that case, okay? So you can create scripts that do this, okay? It basically looks for these, you know, positions that are ready for liquidation and it can actually process them. So it's a two-step system. Basically, you try to find the opportunities and then as soon as they come up, you process a transaction that actually does the liquidation. And this is a lot like the trading bot scenario where basically you create an app that just, you know, looks for this stuff all the time and then whenever it finds the opportunity, it strikes. So ideally, you want to set this up on a server or something like that to run like 24-7 and just watch these opportunities and then make money that way. So the last idea is to run a validator node. Okay, so this isn't exactly like an app that you code yourself. In some cases it is, in some cases it's not. But this is still an area where having like developer skills is gonna give you a huge leg up. So I'll explain what I mean by that. There are two really specific validator use cases that I want to talk about. All right. So the first one is becoming a validator that just runs a blockchain network. So Ethereum is an example, and I'm mostly talking about Ethereum 2.0. So right now, Ethereum uses miners, which is basically like one of the computers that runs the network and processes the transactions because Ethereum is a proof of work blockchain, where basically, you know, they uh, reward miners with cryptocurrency for mining those transactions. But when Ethereum 2.0 goes online, the miners are going to get replaced by validators, okay, which basically stake their cryptocurrency to the network in order to process transactions and they you know earn a passive income reward for doing that so in order to become an ETH 2.0 validator you know you have to hold 32 ether which you know the time recording this video has got a lot more expensive than i first made videos on this but in addition to holding that cryptocurrency you also have to run a node which basically means you have to maintain your own uh computer process that helps run the ethereum network and that could be on you know uh your own system that you you know host at home you could do it on a cloud server and so that's how that would work all right so ethereum 2.0 no, it's not live yet, okay? But if you want to, you know, start, you know, running your own Ethereum 2.0 node, you can do that right now on a test network. And I just created a video recently that shows you how to do that. Now, in addition to Ethereum, there are lots of other validator opportunities out there. All right, so one, another big one is the Chainlink protocol. So Chainlink is a decentralized Oracle network. So it's not a blockchain in itself, right? It actually talks to Ethereum. But what it does is it uses, uh, you know, computers like a blockchain network uh, to achieve consensus on real world data. For example, if you want to get a real world cryptocurrency price, like the price of Ethereum, for example, well, you can ask Chainlink what that information is. And then a, a you know, a network of validators will provide that information to you reliably. Okay. So, uh, you can become a validator for that. Basically, you set up a computer that does that and you provide that information to the network. And so this is not quite as like a set it and forget it, you know, passive income opportunity as like running an Ethereum 2.0 node is. It's more like running a little digital business, okay? But once you have it set up and you're able to fulfill requests, then it's rinse and repeat and that's where the more passive, uh, you know, part comes into play. All right, so those are four different passive income apps that you can build as a blockchain developer. So make sure you check out those videos that I mentioned you know, throughout the video. And as always, smash the like button down below for the YouTube algorithm and subscribe to this channel. And if you want to develop the coding skills to build these types of apps, then you know how can you get started today? Well, you can go to my YouTube homepage and find any of my free courses listed there. You know, They're like Udemy courses, but they're totally free. I actually put out a brand new one last week that showed you how to build a DeFi app, all right? It's a really hot trend right now in blockchain. So you definitely want to check that out, all right? And if you like those videos and you want to take the next step or hey, maybe you want to take a massive shortcut entirely, then I can show you how to master blockchain step by step from start to finish, you know, build your own real world blockchain application, a DeFi app so that you can, you know, land a high paying job, become a freelancer, you know, build your own project. Just head on over to dappuniversity.com forward slash bootcamp to get started today. All right. So that's all I've got. And until next time, thanks for watching Daffy Diversity.